Hi, I'm Dave from Great West Equipment. Today we're going to show you some of the features and functions of Volvo Articulated Haulers. We are located today in beautiful Vernon, British Columbia. Now we're going to discuss our OptiShift. It works similar to reverse by braking in our wheel loaders in the fact that if you are in reverse and you want to toggle to drive when you're still moving in reverse, it will not smack the transmission into the different gear. It will use the service brakes to brake the machine until the software finds it's uh, safe to click it into the next gear. Here we're going to go without any fuel pedal application. It works similar to our wheel loaders in the fact that if we depress our fuel pedal, the brakes will come on even faster. Reverse to drive, machine slowly brakes itself with the service brakes, we're in neutral, we've come to a stop and now we're in drive. Next round, will we use our fuel pedal and we'll find that the braking application, so the cycle time from reverse to neutral to drive, will be substantially quicker because the, fast, the harder that we hit our fuel pedal, the faster that our service brake will come on. Now we're in reverse and here we go. Stuff it in the drive and we're going to hit the fuel pedal and we're already back in the drive. So within about half the time it will brake the machine quicker and again cycle from reverse to neutral to drive again without any impact on our transmission. Upon reversing, if we shuttle the transmission into drive, our OptiShift will use the service brakes to brake the truck before engaging the drive gears. Reverse, now we're going into drive, you'll see here our service brakes are applied before our truck shifts into drive. Now our truck automatically defaults to the drive position. The other offering to this will be our fuel pedal. Our fuel pedal will become our brake pedal. If we're in reverse and we need to go into drive at an elevated speed, we just need to shift gears faster. Once again, we're now in reverse. We're going to shuttle shift into drive, but we're going to use our, the fuel pedal. You can see that will now brake the truck and shift into drive even faster yet. The harder you depress the fuel pedal, the faster the service brakes will come on to offer a quicker cycling time from reverse to drive.